Hello everybody, Fiber Spider back again with Fallout 4. Alright, so last episode, we worked on Hangman's Alley, and right now, County Crossing. Where you going? Where you going? We could really use your help. Well, you got it. You know, what's, what's going down? Yes, I'm here to help. What's going on? There's a group of raiders that won't leave us alone. Stealing our food and supplies, threatening us if we can't give them what they want. We know where they're coming from, but we can't stand up to them ourselves. All right. Don't worry. I'll take care of those raiders for you. I hope so. We didn't know what to do. All right, so that's Revere Beach Station again. Oh, yeah, we've been there. Well, looks like that's where we're heading. Okay, fine. You know, there there is a a considerable amount of sort of recycling quests in the game, but 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 you still get experience, you still get loot, you still get clout, uh, you know, with the the various game characters. So it's it's not all bad. It is a little redundant, I will say that, yes, but it's not completely useless. So, well, let's go for it, you know. I figure, why not? And then, if there's enough time left over, we will perhaps hey, talk... Huh? Oh, God. Really? Oh, really? Really? <laughs> okay. Shotgun! <laughs> I... <sighs> okay, I got somebody upstairs. Oh, oh, I need to heal. Oh, oh, is that Piper? I... Jeez. Okay. Hello. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Oh. Okay, that did not quite have the effect I was going for. Okay. Now, uh, let's try sniping, huh? Okay. Now, unfortunately, I moved my coffee cup right in front of... Oh, God! My arm! Dang it! I was just saying, I moved my coffee cup right in front of my screen. Oh, no, 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 no. Jeez. Okay, I'm... I'm... Oh, really? Hey, 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 hey. Stop it! Okay. Oh! Hey, who said you could hide? Ha, 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 ha. I'm I'm just I'm just looking for goodies, that's all. Is that is that whoa! So wrong. Oh, you know what? We can now use our perk because I can't break lockpicks anymore. Doesn't matter how much I fiddle and finagle, this is great. This is great! I'm enjoying this very much. Alright, just a little bit more. There we go. Not one lockpick nice. broken. Awesome. Sawsome. Okay. So, the book returned tokens. We haven't delved into that at all. Hmm. Alright, you know, I know we're not alone. Ow. Really? Not cool. All right. So where where is the curmudgeon down there, huh? Where is he? Watch out! Aye. All right. Where are you, huh? Stay down. Huh. 
Whew. Oh, don't tell me we have to go back into the station itself. No, that stinks. Ow. <gasps> really? I'm coming for you. I am very much coming for you. Whew. Okay, yeah, I think we actually have to go into the station, and that, that, I'm sorry, that, that just plain stinks. Because we've been down there. But, we do what we do, right? Right. Okay, now, uh, there was somebody else down here, wasn't there? Yes, no? Maybe. Could have sworn that there was... A young lass. Hmm. Well. Let's have a bit of a look see, look see. Do 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 do. Pardon me, Piper. Pipe, Piper. Just having a look-see looks. See if I missed anything. No, not really. Alright. So, I figure, yeah, I guess we can go downstairs. At least this time I have a better understanding as to the layout, and that's always a bonus. Also, I think perhaps I should swap over to a suppressed weapon so that I don't make quite so much noise Alleeps? Oh, we got roaches! Oh, 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 oh! Die, die, die. Oh, icky, icky, icky. Blue, we're not alone. How perceptive, Can Piper. We, we will. We will. We'll get out of here. Just covering our bases first. What's that? Day tripper. What is that? I am not sure. All right, scooch. Okay, we can go this way now. Oh, 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 oh! Close call. Also, another thing that I should probably do is get my omelets right there. Okay. Oh, okay, we got two. We got three. Oh, I see you. Okay, good. And they didn't hear me. Alright, where are you? Where are you? I want to see you, but I don't see you. This looks irradiated. Oh god! Ew, 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 ew. Excuse me. Alright, where are these curmudgeons, huh? Where are they at? Also, I can deactivate this chain on the door here. Ooh, ghouls! Oh, 
Oh, okay. Not too bad, not too bad. Now the advantage... The advantage is that, uh... Ooh, big pack of duct tape. Um, since we've already been in here, it should be a little bit easier in some respects. And now that my lockpicks do not break, even easier still. Oh, chained from the other side. Oh, okay. No, uh, that's that's perfectly fine. We'll manage. All right. Now, where are these cretins? Hmm. Hmm. Where are you guys at? Oh, here. Hi. Uh-oh. <coughs> Easy enough. For the most part. Okay, still not out of the woods yet. We're getting closer. See, right now I think I'm actually heading... Oh! I see you! Ooh! Got him! Yeah, we're heading in the opposite way in which we had the first time. This is nothing wrong with that, per se. Yeah, we're just we're just going backwards. That's all. All right, come on. Show yourself. I'm trying to get you. I'm trying to say hello in my own inimitable inimitable fashion. Come on. Ah, oh, there you are. Hi. Oh, I have no AP. Okay. <laughs> well, that works. No need to hide. It'll all be over soon. And I completed the mission. Not entirely, but I did. Okay. Oh, hi. Well, I would say let's see what we can grab first. Plenty of goodies, I'm sure. Uh, do do do, skiddly do. You all right there, dude? It's got a bit of the case of the dead twitches. I think... I think we're good. All things considered. Now, where to go exactly from here? Could try going through there. Yes, no? Maybe so? Dead end? Oh, hello. enough. One thing I do not mind is picking up more ammo. And, I mean, I know I already have tons 
And don't get me wrong, I am not complaining. Oh no, 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 no. Not complaining, just commenting. Hey dude. Ooh. Uh oh. Just stay dead. You know, do me do me that favor. Right, where where's your friend? Where's your friend? Where's your friend? The one whose head exploded. Like a big pulpy mess. Well, here's bits of him at any rate. Um Yeah, I think that from here we can just go upstairs, right? Ew, ew, ew. Not a fan of the roaches. However, they do give me num num, so I'm not complaining. Do not lean against doors. Do, 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 do. We did it! Very cool. That that was actually a lot faster than the first time we were down here. A lot faster. Then again, I I have a little bit more experience under my belt, so not bad. Not bad at all. So now I can return to County Crossing and tell them it all is well. And maybe we could continue on with Nick Valentine. That would be cool. That, that would be fun. Powered perk increases both your strength and endurance during daytime hours. Hmm. May even heal radiation and hit points. That's pretty cool. In the sun? Because what if it's raining? Or what if you're inside of a building, but it's daytime hours? You know, does it doesn't make a difference. Well, at any rate. Hello. Okay, where's the man? Hello, man. Did you have any luck with those raiders? Yep. Took care of them. I took care of those raiders for you. Really? Well, that's the best news I've heard in a long time. Well, I do what I can. And gunfire in the distance, of course. And they want me to talk to Preston, of course. But we're not going to do that right now. Okay. Now, let me just check something real quick. Okay, well that's done. Let's go to Valentine's Detective Agency. Diamond City. Let's... Yeah, let's go. Why not? I know his name is Nick Valentine, but I keep on wanting to call him Humphrey, or Bogart, or, you know, I do. He's just, oh, I love him. And if I'm not mistaken, he can be a companion. I'm not sure, though, but I think he can. Let's see if we can find him. Hey, kid. Hey, you were in the paper, right? All right, let's see which way. Been a while since we've been down this way. Ah, there we go. Valentine Detective Agency. Knock, knock. Allie, are you here? Nick. really you. Well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. 
You're welcome. Hey, happy to do it. Yeah? Go diving into scary pre-war ruins all the time then, do you? Yep. Here. I know an amount wasn't on the table when you went out to find him, but you deserve a reward. Plus a little something extra. You know, if you're looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat, Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. All right. When you're trying to find someone who's gone missing, the devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. All right. Well, um... I'll describe Vault 111, because that's where it happened. We were in a vault when it happened. Vault 111. It, it was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice, huh? More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. A lot of obstacles to get through just to take one person. What else can you tell me? Okay. Um, describe the kidnappers. There was a man and a woman. They didn't say much. But I remember they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team. Professionals. The kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. Not sure what the backup means, though. Anything else you remember? Well, the backup to me, I don't I do not know, but my guess is that it's about my DNA. You know, like I, I can give them another kid you know in some respect you know uh that, that that's just my guess in a boy and his dog kind of way you gonna talk? yeah i'm i'm talking here all right let me describe sean we're looking for my son sean he's less than a year old why would anyone take him good question why your family in particular why an infant would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Now that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. Hmm. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the Gunners, and of course there's the Institute. Um, well, we really don't know that much about the Institute. We know plenty about super mutants and raiders, so... So you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. Something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. I'm a synth myself. It's got a prototype anyway. Uh, let's see. Finding Sean. Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? Alrighty. Uh... Distinctive voice. I'll never forget that voice. Low and rough. Like sandpaper across your face. Huh. Not much to go on, but a tough and commanding voice can get someone pretty far in the violence business. What else? Okay, well obviously he carried a gun. Uh, describe the outfits, because bald and scarred, I mean, that describes half the people in the Commonwealth. The woman was dressed in... Um, I think it was a kind of hazard suit. The man had some sort of metal brace on his arm. Maybe some kind of improvised armor? A lot of hired guns do that to look tough. The hazard suit is interesting. Not many mercs can afford something that fancy. What else do you remember about them? Okay. Uh, bald and scarred? One of them came right up to me. Bald head scar across his left eye. Wait. It couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? Well, he wasn't... He wasn't trying to sell me cornflakes. Uh... 
honestly, I do not recall. It, it's been many, many episodes. Kellogg? Who is he? Do you think he has Sean? Hmm. Way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned West Stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. Hmm. It, it, it might be, it might not be. It depends on when they defrosted me. So, uh, he's in town? You said he lives here? He's still in town? They both vanished a while back, if I'm remembering right. But that house is still there. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. Hmm. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but... You two should still be careful. I always am. <laughs> All right. Well, can I get up, please? There we go. All right, let's go. Go, please. Can I not open the door? There we go. <laughs> All right, so we're on a cornflake goose chase of sorts. Okay. Nick. Kellogg's house is this way. All right. I didn't want Ellie to hear this, but I think you should know. Everything I dug up about Kellogg before his disappearance, bad news. Of course. He's more than just a mercenary. He's a professional. Quick, clean, thorough. Has no enemies. Dead. Hmm. Except you. Nine to one odds says he's our man. More than just you identifying his distinguishing features. The MO is all him as well. Leading a small team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later. Not many mercs in the Commonwealth can pull that off. Are we heading in there, or where exactly? You going in? Here we are. Hey, Valentine. Hold your horses. <laughs> hey, I could have done that. Something to hide, Kellogg? Why don't you give it a try? Of course. I'm not too shabby with a lockpick. Especially now. See, now whenever I come across a lock, oh, I'm just going to want to get it for the experience points, because now I, I, psh, I'm in the clear. Kellogg must have left something behind. Oh, I'm sure he must have. Okay, let's have a bit of a look-see, huh? What is in that case? Well... My guess is that there's probably like a secret entrance somewhere, which would make total sense. Uh, nothing here. Did you check out that desk? I'm looking, I'm looking. Handcuffs, huh? I'm telling you, something's not right. Look for anything out of sorts. Oh, I Wait. am. See, I'm guessing that this right here is something. Oh, wait. Button. Did I... Wait, 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 wait. Oh, there it is. Well, that's one way to hide a room. Da-da-da-da! Ooh, I'm just gonna grab everything. Well, look at this. 
all of a merc's favorite things. Just grab, 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 grab. If he took my son, I'm gonna take all his stuff. Seriously. Gwinnett Stout beer, 44 caliber bullets, and cigars. San Francisco Sunlights. Hmm, interesting brand. It won't lead us anywhere on its own, though. Okay. Uh, we could use dog meat. Well, what are your suggestions first? Any suggestions, Nick? Hmm. What about dog meat? Commonwealth mutt like him can track a man's scent for miles. Why don't you go fetch him and let him have a whiff? See if he picks up the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. You have to face Kellogg on your own. Just say so. Besides, you already have plenty of company. Can't all go sniffing through the Commonwealth after one man. Well, actually, I would like for him to come with me. I want you with me on this, Nick. Okay, so Piper. Uh, I actually, I think I'd like for her to go to Sanctuary Hills because that's where dog meat is. That's where uh, Preston is. Codsworth, you know, just have all of them. Basically, all my companions at Sanctuary Hills. I like the idea of that. All right. Well, let's get that bastard. This is your show from here on out, okay? You say jump, I'll say how high. And I earned a trophy. Never go it alone. All right, so I now have Nick with me, which is pretty cool. I feel bad that I didn't even get a chance to say goodbye to Piper, though. I feel bad about that. But... That is how the proverbial cookie crumbles. Now, um, let's check our quest line here. Okay, so I, we have to go find dog meat back at Sanctuary Hills. So, we can do that. And also, I do have to talk to Preston anyway. Because of the county crossing completed quest. Say that five times fast. Hmm. Dogmeat's here! Hey, boy. <laughs> Dogmeat. Get the scent, boy. Alright, uh... Find Sean or get uh, Kellogg. Well, d do you have the scent? Got something, boy? Okay. Awesome. Okay, well, actually, you know what? Right now, I think I should call it an episode here. I was going to go back to Sanctuary, but we're hot on the heels of dog meat. And uh, I'm afraid that if we go back to Sanctuary Hills, that uh, that might interfere with that somewhat. So, that being said, we're going to end it here. I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you soon. Thank you for watching, and bye for now.